Hello! So one of the fun things we are going to do on this channel are product reviews. So my dogs are super spoiled and they get to try out all kinds of fun products. Charlotte, you want to come say hi? They get to try out fun things and tell you what we think. This is Charlotte. So we um, got, are getting to try a couple of light up leashes. One of them I already opened, um, but I have not... Charlotte. I'm on the dog bed, one of the dog beds. We do product reviews on the dog bed. That's what I decided. So I'm opening this box. So light up leashes. Uh, I'm really excited to try these out. Um, so. so it is the Spotlight Leash. We have it in yellow and we have it in red. The red one I've charged. The yellow one, I'm not sure if it comes with a charge or not, but I wanted to open it um, in camera. So it um, charges with this really cool little USB port that comes out. Ooh, the red one is charged. And it has a couple functions. And I will insert video um, of me trying it with the dogs later. But so the leash, it is leash, really padded handle. You can see that. And then on, on and off switch. So it comes with a couple functions. It does this flashing, and then a slow flashing, and then an on. So the light up part is only this top part of the leash, and then this bottom part of the leash we'll talk about in a second. So here's the red one, and then here's the yellow one that is I haven't taken out at all. So it comes. All wrapped up together, electric yellow. Oh, it's got little twist ties and I don't have, so this is how it comes. You can see, I don't have my scissors on me, but here's the little USB thing. And then, can I get to the power? Let's see, oh, that just comes off. They also come with a free poop bag dispenser and a roll of poop bags. You can never have too many poop bags, so that's nice. Uh, and then, let's see if it has any charge. Oh, it does. You can see it light up. That's cool. It comes with a charge. So I know, Charlotte, are you going to be fancy and light up? You, you know, you're in front of the camera, though. So here's the yellow one. Here's the red one. These are very cool. So I'm a fan. I think the light up is really cool, especially if you walk your dog in, at late at night or in the early in the mornings. If you live in the city, um, we only about a year and a half ago, uh, we live in Brooklyn, New York, only about a year and a half ago, moved into a house. My dogs only recently got their own yard. Sorry, we have a contractor working on the house right now. We only recently got our own yard, or in the relative recently. So until then, we was walking the dogs all the time. And I actually think this would have been pretty cool for that. Um, I am planning to use them on vacation. I think that would be very fun when we stay in cottages that don't have yards. So taking the dogs out at night. Um, so I really like this product. I really like... I don't love how padded the handle is, but I'm kind of a, I'm not a padded handle person. I like to wrap the leash like this. So for me, I wish that the, 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 the color went further down the leash. So that's my first critique. Um, I do think that the flashing is great and that it's rechargeable is really cool. I like that it's just a USB charge. I don't put batteries in it. So that, so that's that. The, the only issue I have with it and I think, they, I think that it was designed to be a feature, is that it's an adjustable leash. So it has this like adjustable thing where it can flip up and you can make it shorter like that and then latch it down. And then it's a shorter leash or you can let it out and make it longer. So that's my, so, that's kind of what I have a critique about. I'm sure for a lot of people that is a feature. For me, it makes me concerned about the stability of the leash. Like I can just slide this. I don't trust that it would hold. Um, I have two big dogs. I have Charlotte who you just saw, who's a 50 pound um, shepherd mix of many things probably. She's a former street dog. She's a rescue who is very, very dog reactive. We have done years and years of training with her since she came home she's come a very 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 long way um i wouldn't trust her on this leash because if i think that i have her close to me 
What I absolutely do not need is her gaining another foot of space because the leash failed. Um, so that's a bummer. The second, the other piece, and my, my puppy who is 17 months old is a hundred pound Newfoundland. She is very good at loose leash walking, but I am not sure. Just safety, like this can so easily slip. Like I am messing with this part down here a little bit. Like I think if I just straight pulled, oh, even straight, yeah. Yeah, my hundred pound Newfoundland, she could pull this to a, a foot longer. So maybe I would use it if I had it fully extended and use it at that space. I will probably use it in a quiet area, fully extended. I 100% do not trust the, um, the adjustable part if you have big dogs. If you have small dogs, um, it would probably be fine. My Chihuahua Dachshund could not, um, none of, he's not a puller, but he, even if he was, he couldn't do this, but I can absolutely just pull that. Um, and my hundred pound dog is stronger than me. My 50 pound dog could pull that. Um, so that's a kind of a bummer with this. I really like the product. I like the, the light up. I wish the light up went this length of the leash. I don't know if they did this extender piece down here as like a feature to make it cheaper so they didn't have to run the light up down the leash. I don't like the handle because I walk my dogs wrapped um, in my hand, my big dogs, uh, as, a, as a safety precaution with my reactive girl and with my, my giant dogs. So a lot of the light is actually in my hand, which kind of sucks. Um, and then this extender thing. So I need to figure out like a star feature on it or not, like how many paws or how many stars up we would give something. I will figure that out before we do the next product review. We have a few products um, to review. Um, but this is sort of, uh, eh. I wouldn't buy it. Um, I don't think for my pack, I think if I had smaller dogs, maybe. But I'm a stickler for safety and the safety features on this. Like, I love that it's light up because that's an awesome safety feature um, if you're walking in low light. But the rest of it just isn't isn't safe enough for me. Like, if I can, I'm not that strong. And if I can yank it, not a good fit. So that's my review. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you want more product reviews from my dogs, um, please let us know in the comment section. Let us know what kinds of products you'd like us to review and we will do that. I will insert some footage um, of the leashes in the dark um, out in our backyard, which is fenced. Um, and so I feel safe putting it on my big dogs because I do think it will actually look pretty cool. Um, and so maybe there's some cool use for that that's kind of neat in a safe place but anyway I hope you enjoyed this video I hope that you and your dogs are having a good day and let us know what what you think in the comment section have you used a light up leash which light up leashes do you like um and what products do you want us to see us review bye show that you're silly show that just turned the camera on while rolling so this is a blooper reel for our um, our video. Evidently, we have those now because Charlotte knows how to ha turn on the, the video recording.